<coughs> so I have the same shape as before. Now I have the distances uh, between those two points here, okay, and this is going to be the uh, this is going to be the Hausdorff bra move distance, uh, which is calculated in a space that's uh, uh, that's not the Euclidean space, but it's actually going to be calculated in a way that's going to be inherent to the shape. Uh, and let's let's leave that aside for a moment. The fact is, we're going to model or we're going to uh, deal with with basically consistent markup of shapes uh, on the different shapes, and uh, and going to track these. So one one thing I could do is to take x and y uh, and put this here okay so that could be x and y and I could have d which basically incorporates some data from both of these uh, in some sense so let's take d here now d is going to be shorter it's going to contain less information than x and y and the thing is x and y are going to be very much dependent on how I move things around it could be x, y, z as well. So if it at the third dimension, it's going to even make it more complicated to model, uh, and there's going to be lots of redundancy there. So I'm not too, too interested in the coordinates of, of points, but just the having selected analogous points in different shapes and interested in the distances between them. Uh, so let, let me just uh, clear this for a moment uh, using a new color. What I want to do then is not to use a general optimizer to try and find the uh, the shortest distances necessarily or to find the best points but to use the same approach that we've been using in PC